Plum here, g'day champions, how's it going? And welcome back to this week's Fender Reset, the greatest on the interweb. This video will cover my top picks, hot ticket, interesting items, and the must buy gear for the week. Following this video, I'll upload a separate video of the full overview of all the gear and all the vendors, along with some nice music so you can all browse at your own leisure. I'm hoping that this format will suit more viewers as you can pick and choose which you prefer to watch. So with all that said and done, no more piss farting around, let's get stuck in. Starting at your countdown vendor this week, where we've got the Born Great that's not even good, let alone great. The pristine example could be much better, it's got health and regen. And the point man, well, it's okay. There's a few different ways that you could roll this one, but personally, I'd save your countdown credits this week. Marco at the Haven's got this lovely M700 sniper. Max out damage and it already comes with damage to targets out of cover on it. So you could roll the talent to whatever you want. <clears throat> Determined. Next door, Roy's got a super 90 shotgun. It does have average rolls, but again, it's already got damage to targets out of cover. So you can pick and choose the talent that you fancy. At the White House, we've got another pristine example, but this one's much better. 12.8 weapon damage and 7.1% headshot damage and the hazard protection could be changed to anything, this is a good one. At the theatre settlement we've got an M1A CQB with Determined. This is a rifle so it does hit less than your snipers, but you should still be able to one tap most NPCs. At the castle we've got an okayish Walker and Harris holster with weapon damage and crit hit chance. Roll the weapon handling to crit hit damage, pretty simple. DZ West has the backup boomstick with Close and Personal. I really do like this one and it's probably my pick for the week. It will cost you 152 DZ resources though, but I think it's worth it. We also have Hunter's Fury Gloves with max weapon damage here. It is up to you, but gear set items are pretty easy to farm for, so I'd save your credits. And the last stop is DZ South for the Point Man. This one is way better than the one at your countdown vendor. It's got solid armor, armor regen, and hazard protection. This is perfect for a support build in Countdown. And the great thing about Vanguard in Countdown is that the bonus armor applies to you too. But unfortunately, that's gonna wrap it up for this week's Fender Reset Champions. If you're interested in the daily targeted loot, it is on your screen now. Thanks for tuning in and make sure that you show your support by smashing the like button on this video. And if you're not already, please subscribe. Everyone's support is always greatly appreciated, and I hope to catch you all in the next one. I'm Plum, Plum out.